Hey everybody, this is John. Welcome to the free video and let's take a look at what's happening just in terms of uh, different markets and things like that. Um, I, what, I'm, what I'm interested in here is I'm just looking for consistency across the board. So we've got the daily chart, four hour, hourly, 30 minute and 15. And this is obviously mixed. The daily chart trend is down, 15 minute chart is bullish. Not as interested in that. There's definitely some trading opportunities there. I'm looking for what's across the board. It's like, oh, S&P 500, green across the board. And you know, until you see the 15 minute chart turn red, you just buy pullbacks, gold, red across the board, right? And so just based on that, I always like to see, is there anything that's kind of setting up here in a squeeze? Well, on the S&P 500, the hourly 30 minute and 15 are all setting up on squeezes and the daily, and it's bullish. So guess what? Looking for higher prices there. We'll come down here, Amazon green across the board. We've got a 15 minute squeeze. Uh, Facebook green across the board with a 15 minute and a daily squeeze. All right, so let's go actually go take a look at Facebook here real quick. And for Facebook, as this comes up and you can see all the put call information and all the option information over here. Now, at this point, in terms of just a play for tomorrow, I like the idea of Facebook kind of going into $120. $120. Um, it's not a huge move, but we do have squeezes, we do have an uptrend, and we are kind of heading into a long weekend. So on this, just set up an iron fly at the 120 strike and the idea that if we go up to 120 and kind of hang out there for a little bit, we'll make money on this call credit spread as well as the put credit spread. And obviously if it blows through 120, we lose money or if it you know gets downgraded tomorrow, we lose money, but it's a very contained trade. The other trade that I like here and we've been kind of nursing this week while I was in New York has been on Google. And Google, we had a nice kind of a daily squeeze when we were down here at about 723 odd some odd dollars, we bought a, the 715, 735 debit spread. And this is one that I just really liked. I liked the setup. And if we take a look at where it is now, what's interesting is that we're now through that strike. And by the way, today I, I bought a few shares after hours, just kind of more, uh, the, the verdict came out with Oracle lost uh, the verdict they had a huge, like a $9 billion lawsuit against Google. They lost. Uh, just the idea, though, that that's news could kind of give it a little bit of a lift tomorrow. And so I just bought some, bought a few shares on it. But the call debit spread is here. And you can see the 735 call still has $7.45 of premium. And if we just trade sideways here over the next week, that's money that we can keep. So that's something that I want to keep an eye on and continue to hold. And then otherwise, the only, other trade, the only other trade that we did today was in Tesla. We had bought some Tesla last week and then today just kind of took profits on it. I still like it. Um, it's just this is, I mean, the options that we had expire tomorrow, right? So I'd like to try to buy some on a pullback if we get it. But, you know, when Tesla goes, that thing can just keep on going. They were seeing so much bearish news on Tesla right now. People were, you know, Bank of America's short, ah, yada, yada, yada. And to me, that just means, I just tells me that shorts are in a panic and Tesla could rip again. No, it doesn't make any sense fundamentally, but that's, of course, um, you know, this stock does not move based on fundamentals, all right? And then last but not least... Uh, just going into the weekend tomorrow, the long weekend tomorrow, if we look here at the spiders, uh, we are, now we do have a squeeze, and, and we are kind of near some resistance levels, but um, I'm looking for kind of a grind, especially you can see this prior high right here, just kind of a grind into that level, not a break through it, but just a grind towards that level into the long weekend. All right, hope it helps. You guys have a good night, and we'll see you at the next update.